better warm her up. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to the Carbon Connection. Um, I'm actually catching up with a really old friend, Mr. Nabil Khan, and he is the host of a channel called Money Talks. He is also a financial planner, financial coach. Um, I'm actually not too sure what his title is, so I'm gonna let him tell you exactly what he does. Mr. Nabi, welcome to, to the channel. Thanks for having me, Yas. You know, to be honest, I uh, don't really know what I do these days. I do a bit of everything, consult. Mostly retired. Mostly Just retired. a full-time ass dad. <laughs> <laughs> full-time dad. Nice, nice. So we are actually in Mr. Nabby's 330D, that is the F30 330D, and uh, it's a special one. It's actually tuned by MPH. It's got a stage two tune and a downpipe, if I'm not mistaken. And today, Mr. Nabby is gonna let us do a zero to 100 test on his car. Let's so if you know, done. previously we've done the zero to 100 test on the E90 330D, and uh, we got a respectable 6.89 seconds on that car, and that's stock standard. Absolutely no mods. Uh, so yeah, let's see what a stage two tune can do. But before we get to that, let's take a look at his beautiful ride. So this uh, car is specced in a very classy silver, as you've seen. It's also got the M Sport back, um, so it definitely does look sporty. So, Mr. Nabi, I believe that you put your car on the dyno at MPH. And yeah. in stock form, what sort of power did it make? On uh, stock, it did 155 on the wheels. 155 kilowatts to the wheels. Yeah. Some respectable power. So if I'm not mistaken, on the flywheel, BMW's claimed power figures, yeah. it's 180 kilowatts. So 155 to the wheels is definitely respectable. Yeah, you should see it after. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, yeah, tell us about after. What after. sort of power did it make, dude? You know, post COVID, I'll tell you, do you buy a new car, do you not? Yeah. Right? And the answer to that is why <laughs> you buy a new car. Yeah. Right, so, I mean, it sits on a guy, right? Especially if you like driving and mm -hmm. enjoy the time in the vehicle. I'll tell you after stage two, it is pretty much a new car. Yeah. So the numbers after stage two was 216 on the wheels and 645 uh, torque. So 645 <laughs> Newton meters of torque. <laughs> that's more than an F80 M3 puts out. So that's a lot of pulling power, dude. Yeah. So yeah, simple that's tune, enough. simple tune, downpipe, stage two tune, and uh, yeah, more torque than F80 M3. Let's see how that relates on the road. So we're going to hook up our draggy unit and uh, see what it can do 0 to 100. Let's hope Mr. Nabby's uh, launch control is working <laughs> and let's see what he can do with putting the traction down. Okay. 
BMW user using an indicator. What sorcery is this? Yeah, it's scripted. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, we went out and did that and realized that I forgot the drag unit at home. But here's a little sneak peek at uh, Mr. Nabby's studio. So yeah, let's go out there and uh, get the zero to 100 time done. This is our drag unit supplied by Ren Sport, as you can see. So yeah, pretty simple unit connects via Bluetooth to your mobile phone and the Draggy app. And yeah, allows us to test some zero to 100 times. Let's go. So while we make our way to a private enclosed road where we can test this safely, um, I'm gonna pop a link to Mr. Nabby's channel down in the description below. If you want some advice on how to manage your money and a lot, lot more when it comes to financial planning and stuff like that, go check it out. Money Talks with Nabil Khan. In addition to that, he's got his own masterclass on Udemy. So this gives you a one-on-one -on -one experience, almost like a classroom experience, um, but virtually on the A to Z on how to plan and how to manage your money. So go check it out and yeah, we'll leave a link down to that you know description below as well. So we are getting close to our private road that we found uh, closed off and away from the public where we can safely test our zero to 100. But before we do that, we're gonna show you guys how to activate launch control on pretty much any BMW that is equipped with the 8-speed ZF Sports Automatic gearbox. So how do you know that you've got a BMW with a Sports Automatic? It will have this specific gear lever and not the other one in the normal autos and it will be equipped with a battle shift as you can see. So we're going to show you a quick tutorial on how to actually activate launch control on the 8-speed ZF. So first things first, pop it into Sport Plus. You'll then see that it is in Sport Plus and dynamic traction control is activated. You're then going to put the gearbox into sport mode by pushing into the left like Mr. Nabi has done here. You then plant your left foot onto the brakes and floor the accelerator until kick down. As you see, the flag appeared on the dash and that's when you know launch control is active. Perfect. Shall we go? Zero to 100 did uh, this bad boy do, Nabi? Okay, that sums up our zero to 100 test. Nabi, happy, satisfied with our 5.5 verified time? You're making me want to make more videos on it. <laughs> Let's see what else we can do to get that time faster. I think <laughs> next up we need to do a full on quarter mile. I Let's see so. what she can put down. Quarter eh? mile? Yeah. So let's put things into perspective. You're running more torque than my FATM3 did. I ran a 12.4 quarter mile on the FATM3, Nabi. Where do you think the 330D would be? What is your time in the quarter mile? 12.4. 12.4? Yeah. You can pull a 10.8. <laughs> you know, big talks from my <laughs> talks. Hey? So guys, that sums up today's video. Thanks for tuning in. Um, Mr. Nabby is definitely satisfied with his stage 2 tune. So stage 2 and a downpipe. Um, so remember, the first test that we did was an E90 330D. And we did a 6.89. I'm assuming F30 in stock form would probably be about 6.5, 6.6. And you've done a 5.5, .5, which is a very respectable time. I was actually telling Mr. Nabi that he could probably destroy an E46 M3 with ease. Well, for anyone who has an E46 M3, oh, is that a call out? To the test. There's a call out, guys. <laughs> you've got an E46. Let's uh, bring it out there and see what it can do versus the Money Talks 330D. Thanks so much for tuning in. As always, please like, comment, and subscribe. And remember to check out Money Talks with Nabil Khan. Uh, and yeah, as always, we appreciate your time and appreciate you supporting our channels. Peace out. Thank <laughs> you.